All right, officer. Tell me what happened. Who's this dead guy and why is he dead? Ah, uh, he must be Detective Robbins. I've heard so much about you. Uh, yeah. That's nice, kid. Now, about this corpse here. Oh, right, sorry. Please excuse my fangirling. The victim's wallet was most likely stolen after he was killed, so we don't know his identity. Forensics is working on that right now. I see. Well, do we know the method of murder at least? He was bludgeoned to death with a socket wrench. And if I may ask, how exactly do you know all that? Well, because I saw it happen. Well, if you saw it happen, then where's the stinking culprit? Oh, he's right over there. He's been there the whole time. They ain't gonna get my gold. It's all mine, you hear me? All mine. Yeah, yeah, gold, whatever. Well, go ahead and arrest him, Officer, um... Artie. Artie. Jesus, what are you, a five-year-old? Hey, what's wrong with Artie? I don't know, you tell me. Hurry up and arrest this guy already. I... I can't. And why not? I've never arrested anyone before. I hate being confrontational and telling others what to do. Then why the fuck did you join the police force? Well, I really like the uniforms. Moving on... Looks like I'll have to take the law in my own hands and arrest them myself. All due respect, Mr. Robbins, you're just a private investigator. I can't allow you to do that. Yeah, and what are you gonna do? Arrest me? Step aside. Hey, your one phone call can wait, pal. I'm taking you in. <laughs> it wasn't me. It made me want he did. What the Killed my hell? friend right in front of me. But I didn't do it. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. Well, if it wasn't you, then who the hell was it? 